Hey guys, it's me, Waddler, and I'm a duck, and today I'm going to show you how to make this car that I've got here. So right now it doesn't look like much, but as soon as I flick this switch and hit F, the wings come out, and I'll start flying in a second. Like, look, I just got off the ground with this flying car, and it can return to being a normal car when I want, so I turn off F and then turn off its gliders and you see when the gliders are off double car physics not just like a gliding down really slowly and I could fly again like this so I think it's really cool so let's get straight into the tutorial okay so before you build it you will need scale tool and screwdriver tool and it does work for mobile so let's get straight into building it so start off by placing a wood block and then a wood block on top of it with anchor block on and merging level red then place down titanium block and delete the wood blocks now scale out this block to 8 by 12 in this direction now place two titanium blocks here and here and on the side two here here now in the corner gaps you can put the wheels i'm gonna put on back wheels like this and front wheels like this and you've just got this base plate so now you can add some minor aesthetics or any amount of aesthetics but keep in mind you want to use plastic for it or else it might become too heavy so scale this up like that and just scale it across like i did here so you know this is across and up a bit and place down a block here scale this across and scale this to far do the same at the back so scale this across after flattening it scale it up and then scale the block across and make this one go to five so it's slightly bigger and place two blocks here here flatten them scale them across and this one too so you have this basic car body shape now just add your windshield, so rotate 45, scale this down, scale it in, scale it up. Let's scale to 0.5, scale this across and scale this across, like that. So you've got a basic car body. I'm just going to paint my car green, because I think it'll look good if I paint green. And I'll paint the visor on the windshield a, a, a darker blue and paint the wheels black and then place down my driver's seat with rotate 90 and just paint it black as well and now there's a few modifications you need to make to the base car to turn it into a flying car so first of all just make this front piece collision off because the wheels can jam on it then place two boat motors at the back of the car like this make them invisible and non-collision i just forgot to invisible them there now they're invisible and now place a plastic block behind the driver's seat scale it in and then scale it all the way this way then one in on each side to make it as thin you can make it as thin as you want but this thing, thin will work so just scale this up to a hundred and then get to the top of it however you can after making a plastic platform so place a block flatten it and go out three at each side to make the platform so one two three one two three one two three one two three and then get up there however you want like i said so i'm just gonna portal my way up there like this and then on the top here i'm gonna place a switch in the middle of it doesn't matter what that switch binds to but place two balloons on each side of here then a balloon in the middle so it binds to that seat down there so just scale this balloon up by one then scale this other balloon up by the specific amount 0 0.47 0 0.47 so that much so up like this up like this so it has to be the exact measurement or it won't work properly so now that you've made the basic flying mechanics 
we can make them invisible and non-collision. Oops, I deselected them. We select these again and invisible. So now that these are invisible, place down a switch here and it'll bind to those two up there like it's supposed to and then delete the seat temporarily while we make the wings that come out the side of the car. So place down a piston in the middle of this area of the car in between the wheels. Set the X down length to far and just click it. Then place a titanium rod and then another rod like this. Then place down a server like this and then add a titan not a titanium plastic block and then another plastic block and then just scale this over here actually not with scale 0.47 set your scale to 1 and, and scale it so that the middle lines up with the middle of this so and scale it back like that so it lines up with this middle piston and I'm just going to scale it out to far. Then I'm going to place another piston and have its extend length be 5. Then I'll place down a block, scale it as close as I can get without colliding and scale it slightly shorter than this block like this. And then one more, the piston Oops, I forgot to set slug, so I'll set slug for just double click it. And then I'll place a block here, scale this all the way down, and all the way over here to make a wig like this. Now I'm gonna make a wig at the other side. So I'll place down a piston like this, and then scale it out, not scale it, set piston length to far, then extend it. Place a titanium rod with another rod on it like that. Then on the back side near the back wheels, place the server like that. Then two plastic blocks. Actually, before you place the blocks on the server, we just need to check which way the server bends. So if that one bends up, we want to change this one over here to reverse rotation enabled. So now that we've done that, we can add the two plastic blocks and scale this one out one this way and then line the middle up with that and scale it out to far and then just do what we did on the other side so if you can't remember just do what i'm gonna do so piston extend leg five click the piston and then add a plastic block scale it like this and just make it so it shrinks from this one by one. Then add another piston here to finish off the wing. And we can just finish off the wing with some plastic. So scale this over here and scale it down. And this is symmetrical with the other wing. Now I'm going to paint these wings slightly darker than the car. So I'm going to set their brightness value to about 65. And I just paint this all the way like this. And painted it like that. Now that I've done that, I can place this feet back now. And something important you need to do is you want to collision off the servers. Set their torque up. Set their angles 20. And it'll be good. I forgot to do this one. I'll do this one. So it's set. Now you just want to collision off all three pieces of the wing and the first piston, like that piston there. Collision it off or it can get a bit glitchy. And now that you've done that, the car's ready to save and load. So I'm going to save its flying car. Save it, load it, and let's test it. So unanchor it, hop in it. And just to set it up before you use it, you just want to retract the wings in, like this. So just click the pistons to retract the wings. So I'm just retracting my wings in like this. So my wings are retracted into my car like that. 
And now, if I flick the switch, the wings will extend out. And if you hit F, you see that balloon is the one that's responsible for your flight. And then, if I get high enough, I can show you how to slowly descend a little bit. So, if you double tap F, like double tap like that just to deactivate and reactivate you'll go down without hitting the ground and just turn off these glide balloons because the wings act as your glide and i just drop if by hitting f and right now we're upside down so i'm just gonna get out of it and bye bye off it goes so anyways thanks for watching and goodbye